What's up, what's up, what's up? This is for Libra, Summer Rising, and Venus signs. This is for Libra. My name is D Reader, the Mean All Terror, for those of y'all that are new. And welcome to the Mean All Channel, everybody. Let's see what's coming in for Libra. So we're starting off with deservingness and words of abundance. You have the ability to instantly manifest abundance by choosing powerful and positive words. Always describe your own words as economic terms in the loving and optimistic terms. And that's exactly what you will attract. And then we also have raise a promotion. So for those of you that work on a five or it's been working really hard towards a raise of promotion, congratulations. I do see that in the future coming up for you. We got unlimited ideas and severe vows of poverty. And we also got declutter. So we got you will feel better and more focused if you take the time to clear away the clutter from your living and workspace. Donate what you can to others who may need your items and be sure that your schedule is cluttered as well. And we have detox your friendships. So we got your abundance flow is being affected by the people whom you're spending time with. So be discerning about your associates and relationships and choose to be with people who are inspiring, generous, and supportive. So Detoxing your friendships, that's going to be extremely important, especially for those of y'all that feel like you have toxic friends. Here's your confirmation you do. You do have some toxic energies around you that are stopping you from manifesting, growing, and, you know, being a better version of yourself. And we also have positivity, faith, and optimism. You open doorways to positive experiences and opportunities with your positive expectations and energy. Do not allow negative energy or temporary setbacks to interfere with the path you are on. Keep the faith and keep going. And as you sleep, God, your angels, and your higher self are given a divinely guided answer and solutions. Be sure to record your dreams in a journal because you can contain valuable insight that will help you manifest your dreams into reality and do the work. So, for a lot of my Libras, it's not enough to just dream or pray. I even had to tell myself that you can talk to God. You can talk to spirit all day. But if you're not ready to walk, crawl before you walk, it's going to be hard to make it. It's going to be hard to see things from a different perspective. And we got ask for your needs to be met and no more complaining. So complaints are affirmations. So you do realize when you are constantly complaining about something, you're affirming that into your life. And then we got to do some research. Maybe do some research on what you're wanting in life. And we also got vegetarian. For some of y'all, maybe this is changing up your diet. That's playing a big part in your, you know, eating these unhealthy foods plays a part in your mood as well. And then we also have birthday. Happy birthday to my Libras. I'm October the 14th. Feel free to free leave yours in the comment. And we also have sun. So for some of you, if it's not your birthday, it could be your son's birthday. Maybe your son is a Libra. So keep that in mind, too. We are in Libra season. Some of you are worried about the safety of your son. Your son is protected. Your son is being watched sober literally right now as we speak. And we also have perfect timing and travel. So this is the right time for you to move forward. And upcoming trip proves to be life-changing in positive ways. So I do see you traveling very soon. And I think this is more for like a personal reason than anything. And then we also got to get some exercise. As your body becomes stronger, you will feel stronger in ways and stand up for your beliefs and only say yes to what you really want. So that's going to be extremely important for a lot of my Libras as well. Just but especially for those of y'all that are, you know, wanting something different or wanting something new. What else is coming in for Libra right now? So we got debt paid off. All that old weight and habit of debt is lifted from you and your life. And we also have your desires is within reach, have faith, everything is working in your higher favor. So that's going to be extremely important for a lot of my Libras as well. Let's see what else is coming in for Libra right now. So we have reconnect with Mother Earth and move your body. So maybe this is like dancing, doing a little ritual. Something to bring you back to life, especially for those of y'all that were just feeling hurt, lost, and damaged. And we also have enjoy new beginnings and notice the signs. So you do have a new beginning in Rider, you Libra. The universe is going to be sending you a lot of signs, a lot of signals. This is celebrating change, and this is celebrating stepping into a completely new period in your life. Let's see what else is coming in for Libra. So, 
We have via open channel mediumship, ancestors, and spirits, and family connections, especially for those of my Libras that are wanting to reconnect with a family member. This family member is very open to communicating with you, Libra. This family member is very open to, you know, talking to you. We got to connect with past loved ones. So this is what a lot of my Libras are tapping into the spirituality or tapping into the spirit form. But realize it's nothing to be afraid of. Y'all going to laugh, have fun, talk about old times, Libra. Be, don't be afraid of this person. Don't be afraid to see this person. A lot of my Libras are afraid of seeing this person. Don't be afraid of seeing this person. What else is coming in for Libra right now? I appreciate y'all. So we do have remember who you are and back to the basics. So this is getting back to who you were before you let the situation take over you. This is getting back to who you were before you allowed this person to get up under your skin so much that they brought out a bad side of you. That's the thing for a lot of my leaders right now. We got a new beginning come out again. A lot of y'all are moving. And we got separation. So we got to delete apps that you rarely use. So for some of you, maybe this is letting go of dating apps. For some of you, maybe this is letting go of social media. And then we have reduction, mode of line, and desire. Send a postcard to your friends. So for a lot of my Libras, maybe this is shooting out a text message. Nobody's sending out postcards in 2024. Now let somebody like locked up for something. And if that's the case, then yeah, send it. But other than that, shoot a text, shoot a phone call. Now I ain't gonna lie, Libra. I kind of went through a situation recently. I reached out to somebody, you know, that I used to be cool with in the past. And um, this person is like a big OnlyFans content creator. And they were so nasty. Back to me in return to where I told myself, you know what? i never reach out to somebody again. But then I had to realize, you know, when certain people do certain things, that energy kind of starts to wear on them. You know, this person used to be like a really nice, really cool person. And, you know, now they're like a big OnlyFans content creator. You know, I was just reaching out to see how they was doing. And, yeah, they were really nasty. So I'm like, okay, you know, I understand not wanting to reach out to people. Sometimes, Libra, because you feel like you might not get a good reaction. Or maybe this person might be, you know, a little full of they self now. Or... Maybe y'all just aren't on the same vibration, but still continue to be that good heart, Libra. Still continue to be that good energy. And we got persistence in. This is willing to take that pressure and climb this mountain. And to go around this mountain, regardless of the circumstances, Libra. You're going to get through this moment. And then we also got go to the gym and exercise. Now, for some of my Libras, you know what's so funny about this? I have a gym in my neighborhood, right, Libra? And I'm a fellow Libra, but it's so hard for me to get up and go. But if you're wanting more better results as far as your body and your health, focus on that effort. And maybe going to the gym could be key for a lot of y'all. Now, remember, Libras, if you can send in for Libra, that would be great, y'all. So if you're on YouTube, you can send a super like is your way to support. Um, besides, of course, like and sharing and subscribing. And if you're on TikTok, the CA is pink, y'all. All right, y'all. What else is coming in? So we got peace, share delicious foods with neighbors, and give up. So we got running in the rain. Some of y'all literally put so much energy. You had to just kind of walk away. And regardless of the circumstances, even if it was running away, you were worried about getting sick later. You're going to be getting fed some information very soon, Libra. So just keep that in mind, too. What's going to be the final message for Libra? I appreciate y'all and Thank y'all so much, everybody. My name is D. Rina, me and all Terry, for those of y'all that are new. And don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and also comment, y'all. So we have, it's not worth waiting for, and stop waiting. So some of y'all are waiting on something. Some of y'all are waiting on someone. This is the universe telling you that this person or this situation is not worth waiting for. Some of y'all, is literally going to take to February for you to see this. But you will see this. At the bottom of the deck, we have spring. So spring is going to be a renewal period for you. During the fall and the winter, you're going to be focusing on rebranding, stacking your bread, and just evolving all the way around. In January is when you will hit your peak. I appreciate you, Libra. Thank you.